Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. I'm still in my pajamas, but I'm gonna change. We want to go to the little beach house, which is like a beach club in Garraf. It's like 30 minutes from here and kind of have like breakfast, spend the morning. I'm really excited to just like lay under the sun for a little bit. Also, when we come back, I want to show you like some things that I ordered from Aritzia. So let's go change. Today, I kind of feel like wearing blue and this is no jokes. This is the best linen shirt that you're gonna find in your life. This is uh, from Aritzia and it's from Wilfred Free. This is linen. And let me go for the shorts. I brought this ones. They are like beige shorts. I'm gonna put this one, pearls. <laughs> it's from Hilas. I need a big bag because I want to put book, phone, charger, keys. Okay, so extra battery. I'm gonna take this extra shirt and let me put this one on. So now it's Carlos' outfit of the day turn. <laughs> So this is the outfit of the day. At the end, I brought the oversized Aritzia shirt. I'm gonna link it on the description box down below. The shorts are from Oisho, they're also linen, and the tank top is from Aritzia. Honestly, it's like a very comfortable, easy outfit, very much what I use on a daily basis. So this little town that we're going, it's called Garraf. It's one before sieges. So basically next to Barcelona, there's many small towns that are coastal. But what we like most about Garraf is that we used to live here back in 2017. And we thought about moving here when we came to Barcelona, like live in Garraf and then go to the city, work, school, grocery shopping, even like daily activities because it's really small. But at the end, we decided that it was probably not the best idea, especially right away. We like having everything in the city, like we have a food market close we can go to the movies we go shopping we can go walk around and if we live here we would probably need to take the car every single time and drive 30 minutes so maybe for the future i think this is a very nice town to like live when you have like kids and you don't want to go out that much maybe i mean i'm someone that doesn't really like going out that much anyway I'm really hungry. I hope they had good breakfast. You're telling me they had good breakfast, so I'm taking your word. The coffee is really good. They have um, eggs and you okay. know, bread. Bread? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go.
so we came home a little bit earlier so i actually have something to show you so i don't know how many of you guys remember but i really wanted to get a dress not as a wedding dress but we're gonna have to do like the civil wedding besides like the full wedding like we're gonna make the civil one here in spain for the paperwork it's probably gonna be before the actual wedding in france and i also wanted it to be like my engagement photo shoot dress and we're not gonna have our rehearsal dinner but we're gonna do like a dinner the day before the wedding and i wanted to get a dress for that so the other day i was like on the web Website. and i was i don't know if it was like yolo i i know that we don't use yolo that much but i first found this dress with a tiktok and it was a girl that was trying rehearsal dinner dresses like it was like for her wedding with her mother-in-law and it, there was like a one second clip of this specific dress and i was like where is that from and i couldn't find it anywhere white dress with a cape and it kind of looked like lambon which is around so i was like maybe it's from lamba and honestly it's really my style like i'm very like this with things that i like like i like shirts like this i like dresses like this pants same thing so i saw this dress and it kind of got like stuck in my head so i was walking in paris and then i come across the lambon store and i see the dress at lambon and i was like you know i need to go and try it so i went and tried the dress i didn't know how much it was and i put it on and i showed it to polo and i was like this is beautiful like it's beautiful i felt very comfortable with it it was stunning it did need a few modifications to it because the front of the dress was perfect for me but the back was a little bit like too long because i'm 5'1 but i saw the price tag and it needed alteration so i was like right now like i'm already quite um overwhelmed and we i just got engaged so i didn't want to buy it i didn't buy it so after that the dress got stuck in my head for months and months and months um it's been january february march april four months now and i still kind of wanted it and the person from lamba she told me that the dress was seasonal so it was not gonna be like available forever so if i wanted it that i should go and buy it i don't know if this is true or not maybe she was making me want to buy it kind of worked so the other day i was just like on the website and was like why not life is too short i think it's a very functional dress for many things in life like the engagement photo shoot whenever we have that we don't have anything planned rehearsal dinner and the civil wedding that i've been thinking that maybe we want to do like something like only our parents and us or maybe even just us but i definitely want to like wear a nice white dress because it's gonna be before the proper wedding so this could be like really nice for that so i bought it so i wanted to open it with you guys i'm not gonna try it on right now because i honestly feel crusty and um yeah i definitely need a shower so i'm gonna take a shower but i wanted to unbox it with you because i've never had like um a dress like this like it comes with its own like box so let's open it up okay so first of all we love the baby blue that the box has this is it's beautiful I am so freaking excited about this. Okay, so I'm guessing this is the receipt. Yep, this is probably the receipt. Thank you for helping with the reveal because this is actually really long. So yeah, but the dress is here. Yeah, you have seen it before, so it's not a surprise. Uh, yeah, I'll pick it up so beautiful so basically this is it it has like this cape on the back and this is what i feel in love with so i just want to demonstrate what i mean like can you turn it around look at that <laughs> i love it can you see how flowy it is this opens up so i'm gonna show you like pictures of the model i don't want to try it on yet not today at least but i will try it for you later on but it's so flowy and so beautiful do you like it So 
that's the dress i still haven't planned most of it but wedding dress like this is not the wedding dress the wedding dress i'm gonna look about it later on like i think it's too soon the wedding is like more than a year away from now i loved going to the beach house today today is gonna be washing my hair day it does look a little bit bad right now in my opinion and i want to see if i can get a nail appointment because i've been biting my nails and i chipped this one like i do want to know what you guys think about it it was expensive i know but it does make me like happy i feel like besides getting the venue we haven't really done much so getting that dress makes it feel like exciting i don't know and i've never been like that obsessed with a dress ever before in my life like i don't know how to explain it but i would say that it's very me maybe you don't like it and that's okay that's fine if you don't like it but i do want to show you um a few pieces from aritzia before i take a shower i just want to show you what i ordered from aritzia in case you wanted to order it too i tried everything on and i liked it there's only a few brands that i really like when it comes to materials of clothing i don't know if this is just me but every time that i go to like massimo dutti i always feel like the men's section has way better quality when it comes to like linen or even some cotton things and same happens with sarai chanem or overall like i don't find good quality shirts that are not gonna get destroyed by two washes so when i found this one's from aritzia like the blue one that i was wearing today i've washed it so many times and it just gets like softer and better after every wash so i went crazy and i got this one that is like orange but i think it's gonna look really cute for summer i got a striped one of course because i love stripes so imagine this like with white shirts and like a, a tank top or something very summery like the specific ones that you need to get are wilfred relax linen and um i got them in small i think i probably should have gone for extra small and i also got it in gray and another one in white so i think now i'm gonna take a shower wash my hair and work a little bit i think we're gonna watch mama mia tonight <laughs> Hey guys, good morning. It's Saturday. It's currently very, very late and I need to catch up with a lot of things like editing. And I realized that last night I went to sleep and I, I thought that I filmed like my haircut routine, but I didn't. So I'm gonna do that today after we have breakfast. So I'm gonna show you basically what I put on my hair every single day, how I style it. It's very basic, heads up, it's very basic. And today we kind of missed Mexican food. So we usually have breakfast like a piece of bread and coffee. Today I had American coffee instead of like um, espresso but Polo went to the food market and he got some stuff to make chilaquiles so this is gonna sound for anyone that is not Mexican you're not gonna understand but we absolutely love chilaquiles it's basically tortillas with hot sauce that's it that's the thing it's spicy hot sauce with tortillas and it's just so good like the thing that I miss the most about Mexico is definitely the food so Polo is making that and I'm very excited I haven't had any like Mexican Mexican breakfast in like eight months. I am very excited. I also need to make the bed and I need to clean and I need to edit. So let's get to it. Good morning. Hi. Yes, I told them that you're doing chilaquiles. So these are not the best tortillas, but they are. The yeah, they're the ones that we have like close to the apartment and this is looking like this. Good morning, Masha. So what are those? Those are dried chilies. We don't have like regular chilies, like chile serrano, the green one. So these are the chile secos, the like dried cheese, dried cheese, dried chilies. Dried chilies. <laughs> and I normally make chile chilies with like green peppers, well, green chilies, chile serrano, but I cannot find it here. So we're gonna try. Also, I have like canned tomatillos. We'll see. Tomatillos. Tomate. Okay, so here we have the breakfast. I have an egg that um, died in the process, but these are the chilaquiles and this is fresh cheese. Are they good? Yeah. Did you them? miss them? Yes. I miss chilaquiles so much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so right now I'm gonna go get my nails done. Let's go. I'm gonna take the slippers off and change to shoes. I'm back from getting my nails done.
month I got French I never change it it's just like the sense of them feeling like clean and I don't get sick of them and I tend to get sick of anything that I do to my nails constantly so yeah I'm always wearing like this much is right here since last night I didn't really explain or show the products that I use for my hair I want to do it right now I have a ponytail I didn't really do my hair today so I braided it when it was still a little bit wet so it's definitely not looking its best so I will be using the Dyson today um, just to do a blow dry so ignoring the crazy hair I usually do the same with my hair constantly like I don't change shampoo I don't change like the products that I use or anything so the shampoo that I want to recommend you is this one this is from Moroccan oil it's the moisture repair I know that you're gonna see it like flipped because I'm filming with my phone right now but I'm gonna link everything in the description box down below and I also use the conditioner with it so these are the two that I use I tend to wash my hair every three days maybe four I try to push it a little bit but my scalp does get a little bit oily from time to time after that I use this when my hair is damp and this is from Tech Italy it says Due Facetta Massimo Treatment Moisturizing and repairing treatment Found this one day, works really well for me So you shake it because it like it's separated And what I use to avoid damage with heat is this one So this has worked really well for me And it's also from Tech Italy So basically I use Moroccan Oil and Tech Italy And this one is Silk System Shine I only use the Dyson I don't have a hair strainer I don't own one And I don't own a curling iron or anything Anything like that so I think I'm gonna use the Dyson and I'll show you the results Well, we ended up deciding to go to dinner and to the movies. I changed because sometimes at the movies it's quite hot, so I wanted to have a t-shirt underneath with my Frankie shop coat. And the bag is my boy bag. But is wearing this cute little number. Number. We ended up deciding to go to the movies and for dinner, so we're watching right now. 